By reading what is written on the internet, you could be led to believe that precursor crafting is the holy grail of game design, but when it finally arrives, will it turn out to be a disappointingly non-divine cup? The recipes for precursors will probably contain a mountain of time gates, so the value of the diabolical weapons may not even drop a whole lot. However, the more absurdly outrageous prices may reduce for a time as everyone rushes to try and sell a crafted version. But surely the more tangible progression will make the whole process less agonising? In some ways, yes. The current totally random method of gaining precursors leaves a sour taste in the mouths of nearly everyone, especially when they see people play less than them and display their luck proudly for everyone to see. Having said that, the preferred method of farming gold to make a soul-crushing purchase on the trading post is simply going to transform into farming less gold to buy materials and mixing that up with time to avoid a pulverised soul. In the end, it will come down to how much time is required. After all, time literally is money in this situation. Therefore, the amount of waiting around will determine the volume at which My hammer. What savings? is yelled at.